Well, it's a gang that goes by the name Sex, Money, Murder. And Polk County Sheriff Grady Judd says that's how its members live. But thanks to a major operation, they've dismantled part of that group here in Florida, and at least a dozen of them could be looking at life in prison. Fox 13's Josh Cassio following the story from Polk County. And the sheriff is calling these gang members really dangerous. You know, Cynthia, he, he did. He did call them very dangerous people, people who had really no regard uh, for human life. You know, sex, money, murder, it wasn't just the name of this gang. It was really their mantra or the, the motto that they lived by. And after more than a year of investigating tonight, at least 41 alleged members of the gang have been either arrested or charged, and likely more is on the way. This gun will never be used again by a sex money murder person. Guns, drugs, and ruthless violence. It's all said to be part of the day-to-day -day life for members of the sex money murder gang. Well, think about this. They went into one home invasion and pistol whipped an eight-year-old child. Did you hear what I said? Tuesday, the sheriff, alongside members of several organizations, announcing they'd essentially gone after the head of the snake by dismantling the gang's hierarchy in Florida. 41 alleged members arrested or charged, including 12 facing racketeering charges, which, when coupled with gang activity, could put those folks away for life. If they're not in prison, they're robbing, shooting, and killing. They're just going to. The evil must be contained. And that means taking dangerous people out of our communities and putting them behind bars where they cannot hurt anyone else. As part of the investigation, detectives used what the sheriff called a gang wiretap, or T3, a first in Polk County. Members basically informed on themselves. Oh yeah, gang members, listen up. We can intercept your social media. You can't pay attention to all that hype you hear. We got it, and we got them because of it. The Sex Money Murder Gang is a national organization. It's an offshoot of the Blood Gang. Investigators also took down leaders of North Carolina's chapter. They're so ruthless. They're so dangerous. We need to bring to the community's attention what they are doing. And the sheriff says the investigation is still ongoing. They expect to have more arrests and more charges in the future. We also know they're still looking for at least uh, two alleged members of the gang, including the head of the gang here in Florida. He is 36-year-old Hernando Thompson Jr. Uh, from Orlando. And Cynthia, get this, his nickname, he goes by T-Murder. Go figure. Anyone with information should contact police. Back to you. That is all scary stuff, but uh, 41 arrests sounds like a lot of people off the street. So uh, we'll oh, yeah. keep up with this and see where it goes. Thank you, Josh.